Hello guys welcome to celebrity news and lifestyle where we give you the right update and all of what you will like to know concerning our music stars and movie superstars, so if you're new here or if at all you're just passing by for the first time, please take some minutes of your time to subscribe, like, comment and hit the notification button so that you don't miss in any of my uploads. IBM is bringing sports into the digital age, starting with the US Open. More than 19 matches were played on 17 courts during the exciting and lively first days of the US Open, which draws thousands upon thousands of tennis fans from around the country and the world to Flushing, Queens. While everyone wants to be in 20 places at once, even with the great technological advances of the 21st century, this seems almost impossible. Where is she? Although IBM can't help you with teleportation, it can do the next best thing. By partnering with the US Tennis Association IBM is pushing the sport into the digital age, leveraging its incredible data capabilities through analytics to create truly cutting-edge human experiences for fans, coaches and players. For more than two decades, IBM has worked with the Asta with one goal in mind. As Noah Sikken, IBM's Vice President of Global Sponsorships, said Tuesday, that goal is simply to make the fan experience as amazing as possible. As a company that has been around for more than a century, IBM always asks two big questions when it comes to collaboration, Sikken points out. How can we help our partners move into this new era? The digital era. And what does the digital platform look like today? When it comes to tennis, this answer is very interesting. Behind the scenes of this fast-paced game are equally fast computational and analytical systems, largely based on IBM's resident genius, Watson. From real-time feeds to ball and player movement analysis in Slam Tracker, IBM is expanding the fan experience beyond just watching the game. Based on the belief that more informed fans are more engaged and ultimately happier, IBM used its technology to power analytics that brought new color to the game. For example, an analysis of the 2015 Wimbledon Championships compared how close the four women came to reaching the semifinals. Unsurprisingly, eventual champion Serena Williams ran the least, covering just 5.57 kilometers and averaging less than 8 meters per point. Second-placed Garbine Nuguruza ran further with a total distance of 8.88 kilometers and an average of over 11 meters point. Thanks for watching to the end. If there's something about this video that you like to share, please do share with us. And guys don't forget to subscribe, like this video, share and leave your comment on the comment section below. Your comments matters. See you next time.